again, she just doesn't seem convinced that this is the right opportunity to pounce. And I don't blame her because I don't think it is either. All this water and the fact that... Okay, there she goes. There she goes. As you can see, the buffalo didn't even... Didn't even flint at the off, but this is good because now Big male is back to him as well. the lion will hopefully join forces. Craig, would you mind reversing, buddy? That buffalo is just behind that gray bush, guys. Um, it chased the one, one lioness. Now it's sort of almost got itself inadvertently into an ambush. We can't see. It's got um, the big males, of, looks like they've, there we go, chasing the lions. The males are gonna probably chase that buffalo. He separated himself. So one of the big, here we go guys, just we're going to stand by. That was a, a really bad attempted ankle tap by one of the Matimba males there. Oh. And they didn't they had such a good opportunity. The buffalo looked like they're gonna chase the lions again. Lion hunts. Uh, sorry, buffalo hunt. Because there are some kudu in the area, and it may just make it to the thicket in time. There it goes. There, there is one lion is stalking along the road, but may just be able to cut it off and chase it back into this clearing. Given but at the moment, it is going to be difficult. I'm just going to position the vehicle slightly forward, being able to give Brian a more direct angle there we go. of the lioness that's stalking it. You can hear Kudu barking. I'm not sure if it's that one there that we can hear. And it looks like they're too far off. And that kudu oh, has just really bolted off and left the lion 